ranking member of the Alliance for Prosperity. We think it's critical on multiple fronts. First, because we do think it helps with some of the irregular migration patterns. The second is uh, these countries face an extraordinary burden uh, from the trafficking of drugs destined towards U.S. consumer markets. So it's in our national interest to be of assistance. What you learn as you engage on these issues is that the three nations, El Salvador, Honduras, and Guatemala, have similar issues that they confront. They also have differences among them in terms of some are more advanced in one direction and in another in terms of capacity. In your view, in, in the case of Guatemala, what is the, um, if they were here today with us uh, and, and we were to propose to them, this is where we think we can be most helpful in the short term, what would you say in the next two, three, four years is the most important part of the alliance for us to focus on first in order to increase their capacity to do what I believe, and I think I shared with you, and you share the same view, is their desire uh, to, to make advances. Of all the components that they need, is there one or two key areas that we should focus on as we construct the, the future of the alliance? Thank you for your question, Senator, and indeed, I would say that corruption remains the top priority. We Nothing can move unless corrupt, the, you know, corrupt uh, officials and corrupt members of the private sector are removed from what they're doing. That remains a, an important part. The other part I think is very important is to have greater engagement from the private sector. The private sector is part of the solution and there are elements of the private sector in Guatemala that are interested in being part of the solution. So we need to get the private sector more engaged and continuing with a lot of the uh, government reforms. For instance, tax collections. Tax collections in Guatemala are among the lowest in the world. President Morales has appointed a very effective tax director of the tax office and he's already showing some results. So we need to continue along these areas and also discuss with Guatemalans the commitments that they made in Miami uh, for, the, for the various elements of the plan and keep that moving. On the, on the, on the